uh, working in armed conflicts as a humanitarian organization, we see digitalization through a magnifying lens. On the one hand, we see huge potential of being much more effective in saving lives, in alleviating suffering, and in being able to provide responses and equip populations, vulnerable populations in armed conflicts with greater capacity and greater agency to get the type of information they need and the type of services they need to survive and make a living despite the conditions. But at the same time, we see that digitalization comes with risks of massive misinformation, spreading hate speech that tend to dehumanize the other with dramatic humanitarian consequences. And we see also that using AI and machine learning in new weapons, especially in autonomous weapon systems, raises the challenge of having instances where life and death decisions are taken without any human intervention and any direct human accountability. And we see also that these weapons are having or can have quite unpredictable consequences. So this is why we have called for urgent regulation of such weapons, uh, weapon systems, as a, uh, not only a, a moral and a political imperative, but also a legal imperative to be able to uphold uh, the, the Geneva Convention.